I'm Connor and I'm doing problem six. A and B together can do five jobs in 12 days. B and C together can do three jobs in four days. A and C together can do two jobs in three days. How many days does it take for A to do one job alone? So I set up an equation to start out with. So I set A equal to the rate of doing a job per day. So for example, let's say a equals one-fifth, that means it'd take five days for A to do the job alone. The job alone. So first of all, I made three equations involving A and B, B and C, and A and C. So I started off with 12, which is 12 days times A plus B, because they're both the rates they're adding together since they're both doing the job and they get five jobs done so did the rest with b and c and a and c so four b plus c equals three jobs and then three a plus c equals two jobs so i wanted to find each of these variables so i could solve for this equation so for this one i'm going to solve for b and for this one i'm going to solve for a or for for a sorry so I would do 4b plus 4c equal 3 and then 4b equal to 3 minus 4c. I'm going to get a different pen. So I get 4c. divide by 4, b equal to 3 minus 4, c over 4. So now I'm going to solve for a here. So I'm going to get 3a plus 3c equal to 2. 3a equal to minus 3c, divide by 3. a equal to 2 minus 3c over 3. So now I'm going to plug both of these into this equation. So I'd get 12 and a would be 2 minus 3c over 3 and then I do plus 3 minus 4c over 4 which I got for b and that would equal 5 so I'm going to solve this out real quick so you'd get 8 minus 12c plus 9 minus 12c equal to 5 so you get 17 add the 8 and 9 and add the negative 12 and negative 12 to get negative 24c equal to 5. You subtract the 17 by both sides, so you're going to end up getting negative 24c equal to negative 12. Divide by negative 24. And c equal positive 1 half. And so we're going to plug c back in for a. So we're going to plug back into this equation since you have c. So it's going to be a equal to 2 minus 3 times 1 half over 3. You're going to end up getting a equal, I simplified this so I made 2 4 halves minus 3 halves over 3. a equals 1 half over 3 which is the same as 1 sixth. Now I'm going to plug just to make sure a is right. So I'm going to plug back into the 12a plus, actually not the 12a, I'm going to plug into the 3a plus c because we have c equal to 1 half and a equals 1 sixth so we'll check that. So we're going to do 3 times 1 sixth, which is A, plus 1 half, which is C, equal to 2. And then you're going to get 3 times 1 sixth plus 3 sixths, just simplifying so we can add them. And then we get 3 4 sixths, or 3 2 thirds, equal to 2. And 3 divided by 3 is just two so you're gonna get two equal to two and that checks out so a officially equals one six and so remember how we made a the rate of doing a job per day so if a equals one fifth that means it take five jobs for a to do the job alone and the question is asking how many days does it take for a to do one job alone so since a equals one six it would take six days for a to do 
the job. Oops. And that is our final answer.